All right, Richard Whittington, the one and only, uh, wants to know very simply, why do you offer so few brown sporins? And this is a company-related question, so it's not the one we, which is why I asked if you wanted to do it, because it's about us. Yeah. Um, but that being said, go ahead, give the answer. <laughs> go ahead. All right, fine, go, go ahead. ahead. Um, brown go ahead. sporins are tricky. Um, the, 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 the real reason why there's, why I'm nervous to have always been nervous to add too many different types of brown sporins is because I come from the matchy matchy school um, where getting the belt to match the sporin to match the gilly brogues um, is crazy difficult, especially when you're dealing with two or three different vendors. Mm -hmm. um, our, for instance, our brown belts that we have, we actually have those custom dyed leather to sent sent to our spore maker to match the gilly brogues that we have made by somebody else completely. Um, so it's it's brown is a tricky one. If you are the type of person who needs to match all of the browns, then good luck, or you're stuck with this and that's it. Um, if you're the type of person who doesn't care and it's just brown is brown is brown, I don't care if it's chocolate or tan or you know whatever, um, then fine there's a little you're it's 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 difficult for americans to kind of wrap their heads around that um the that said if there's a uh we kind of been toying around with the idea in general should we offer more brown sports yeah. cuz the we just started doing <clears throat> the uh the Edinburgh day sporn which is like a a chocolate brown meant to look like prince well now king charles um it's still weird saying king I charles know. versus prince I know. Yeah. um the uh, we're still we're doing that sporin that matches his, and we're doing we have a uh, an Edinburgh hunting sporin in a chocolate brown mm -hmm. that kind of mm -hmm. like, is is a similar vibe to his. Yep. So we have like two shades of brown, a tan and a chocolate brown, and then we have black because black is black is black. Black is going to match anything. You don't have to worry about it ever, um, as far as leather stuff from us anyway. Um, but. Let me know. Is there is there a particular sporin that you're like? I wish this one was available in brown and or tan, you know, because there's like a light brown or dark brown. So here, let's use this as a focus group. Okay. Um, do is there a particular sporin you see on our website that you want to see in dark brown or tannish, you know, lighter brown, and which sporin is it, and which color is it you want to see? Sure. Yeah. It's there's there's no reason other than I don't want to carry 897 different sporins, and it's that's a large capital investment mm -hmm. in something that's not necessarily cheap. Mm -hmm. um, but all right, let's 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 warp the question, Eric. What huh. sporin do you want to see in brown? In brown? In brown, that we um, either that we have or some fantastical sporin you want to see. Uh, pass. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, because like I, I tend to go, go more with black. So, you know, but yeah, I mean, something like this kind of hybrid would be yeah. like, Would yeah. you do a brown semi dress? A yeah, brown semi dress could be good. Um, with like a. Um, we don't do the um, raccoon pelt anymore. No. Right? We can you know get what I mean? it. But yeah. Like a brown musquatch or a. Um, okay. Okay. You know what I mean? Or a bad. Not, not badger, but. I could um, see a brown musquatch or a yeah. brown fox. I could see something like yeah. that with a brown yeah, I think flat. That could work. Okay. Yeah. Something like that. Um, Ian will bring you in for this as well. I would say uh, the hunting sporn. I have a brown hunting sporn, and people mm -hmm. ask me about it pretty regular if I post a photo wearing it. So I wish is we it had chocolate a... brown. Uh, no, tan. it was a lighter brown. Okay. It was yeah, it was custom dyed at the time. It, yeah, it's not the tan. It was either. to match one of your belts, I think. Right? Mm, no, I just something I liked. Okay. Yeah. Never mind. Yeah, I'm but even if we what whatever brown, I think a hunting sporn, especially because hunting sporns, I think look so good in brown. Yeah, um, I agree. They, they go with the hunting kind of vibe. I don't disagree with um, that at all. I think the Craigmore... And they're more traditional. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think the Craigmore Day Sporn, but it also does hearken to the, the, the hunting style. It would look great in brown, That's too. the one that Eric normally wears with yeah. the, the leaves on it. Yeah. Yeah. Got yeah. it. Yeah, I think that would be good. Yeah, but I, yeah. I represent the problem for Rocky. The, I, I'm the bane of <laughs> you, Rocky's you existence. You represent a lot of so Rocky's problems. In that I want brown things. I want more of them, but... They're not always the what I. They're not quite the brown that I want. <laughs> and therein lies yeah. my trepidation. I have the two tone 
belt that we used to carry. Yeah. Um, yeah. And don't any I longer. Like don't belt. ask me for it. I can't get it. Um, and we now have a brown belt. And I'm not as I'm not as fan of that 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 shade. So yeah. Uh, people like me are the problem. If you're like me, you're you're part of the problem. <laughs> it's you. <laughs> mm. Yeah. I think a a brown brown black two tone hunting sporn could be pretty cool. The one, the one that uh, uh, if Adam is still listening out there, it's in my office on the side table. Um, go grab that and bring it in. The um, there's a a brown sporn that I had. Um, I had a custom made with our logo, like the lion logo. Yeah. Where one lion head facing that way, one lion head facing that way. Mm-hmm. Um, and I think it's just like regular, like knotted tassels. Mm-hmm. Um, and you have worn one, it on the show. I've worn it a few times, not a ton, but the times I've worn it, like I'm, I'm, I'm not. Um, I I never feel like people want like my branding of my company kind of thing. I realize some people probably do, but. The, uh, it, it's, it's a weird one. I've worn it a few times. I did it for myself and only really for myself. Um, but it's one that I would, every time I wear it, we get some comments about it. So I would consider doing something like that. Maybe. It's a tannish one. Um, maybe, oh, he was listening. Look at him. We have a guest star on the so show. Don't, don't throw it. Um, this is the one I'm talking about there. It just has our logo right and left. And this is not meant to be a product-heavy episode, so I apologize. Yeah, this is um, kind of an But odd. this is this is what I'm talking about by tan, as an example, versus a chocolate brown kind of color. So let us know if something, like, should we just go to the drawing board with, with the brown sporn in general? Is there a design that we currently have that you're like, yes, that thing but brown, or that thing but tan? Or should we do something like this? And it's a laser, laser yeah. cut. For the designs yeah. super fancy i love it this mm-hmm. is my favorite other mm-hmm. this is my this is my secondary sporn it's mm-hmm. this one 98 yeah. percent of the time and this one mm-hmm. is my other one mm-hmm. that i go to yeah so all right enough product placement hey thank you for watching you know what's even better than talking about kilts wearing kilts so please do check out our site usakilts.com we have a lot of things to offer for every level of formality and every kind of style you might want to explore we would appreciate your business